Oh, that's pretty good, actually. Yeah. Well, there's only two of you. Yeah. So, um, you guys sit at a place that's like a homecoming kind of gig for you guys, like after the, the rest of the North Island tour. Yeah. So, made you cry, made you laugh. Oh, oh, all sorts Alton, of things. Alton Toy Wall. Like, Alton Toy Wall. <laughs> Greatest attraction in New Zealand, very underrated. Never, yeah. <laughs> if Joe says to go look at something on the tour, yeah. then uh, he's going to oversell it. Um, That's amazing. Welcome <laughs> Toy Wall. Look it up. Um, we, we've played some great shows, we've had, but we've had like road closures through to like... Yeah, the, the late nights has been killer. The late nights have just been killer. Uh, yeah. You know, going to bed at like, I think we're going to bed at like 8 a.m. one night. Like, one morning. So it's five five days, so it's just a little tour. Yeah. But uh, yeah, so you uh, Napier Gizzy first night of this weekend and that was sort of you know, it was it was it was good. It was good to announce and things like that. Yeah. Um, the driving. Yeah. Other than the driving. Yeah. Um, thankfully we've had Adrian our lot of tech driving, uh, which has been nice. Yeah, we've we've played some good shows, um, been some different audiences, we've met some different people. Um, yeah. And Wellington was sort of nice to just come home to. We played here before heaps, you know. And, you know I mean, Joseph hung out here just watching bands heaps so over the years, so it's, it's nice to come back and yeah. 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 We are hanging out all the time. I know what the house drums are like. I don't need to worry about like, what do I need to bring? Like, I know. Yeah, I just know what to expect. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't have to organize the driving, the accommodation. It's just like. And then from the organizational point of view, like, the holler is the easiest one because they've always got a door person, they've always got a sound guy, they've always got someone sorted. Yeah. Whereas, like, you play with, we were the sound guys, so we were the door people. Yeah, we do hire a PA uh, and set it up. Hire oh, PA. Jesus and, Christ. You know, we've, we've done all that too, so, like, you know, it's, it's nice to come back here and it's nice and easy. Yeah, yeah. You just come in, we sound check, we play. Like, yeah, yeah. You know the rules. You know, we, we know what's going to go on. <laughs> so, yeah, so it's nice to come home. And uh, yeah, but uh, yeah, great, great show. Uh, Hype Wave Tour. Alpha Toy. Alpha Toy. Yeah, yeah like, it's been real cool seeing the different venues. Um, Casey Stage in an APA. Really cool space, um, very fondly. Kind of art memorabilia around the well, like kind of rock memorabilia and you know, lava lamps. Uh, yeah, yeah. Lots of couches, nice rugs, and, and, uh, kind of warm. Sounds oh, good, lights good. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's just a cool space. And then like Smash Palace in Gisborne. It's got a bloody plane over the top of it. It's in an industrial area next to all these wreckers. And, uh, yeah. It's real characters, like a very community vibe there. Yeah, April and New Plymouth. Like it's not really a venue so much. It's it's, it's cobble, but um, it's sort of like stage. really cool. Um, and then Snails and Palmy again, really cool space. Artist project. Yeah, yeah. space. Yeah, it's a creative yeah. space. Because so. yeah. it's like studio space, so there's just art everywhere. It's interesting and like sounds good, good gears. Like, again, community feel. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just kind of cool seeing different places in New Zealand, kind of party centres, creative spaces. And I mean, Joe sort of only joined the band about eight weeks ago, so if you were sort of. I was like, first drummer bugged off to Aussie, second drummer wasn't quite the right fit, and then I said to Joseph, I was like, hey, really like your style, uh, I'm going to tour in like six, seven weeks, did you want to come with me and yeah. <laughs> play some shows? Like, we got lots of shows booked, I think we counted between here and August, we've got about nine shows booked, yeah, yeah. so like, we're busy, and, um, and, and we fit in studio time between that, and you know, rehearsals and all that sort of stuff, so we're sort of... We're, now we're getting to the end of the tour, we've still got a few shows booked, but we're re like, I'm really itching to get back into the rehearsal room and get mixing done, you know, singles, and 
get some stuff released. Uh, you know, like, oh, fine, basically. Yeah, that's my next question, like next steps and things. Yeah, yeah. So we've got two songs recorded. So we need to so master and release them. I don't want to rush that, like. Yeah. Put a plan in place. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. We've just seen things so busy with this tour there. Yeah, you know, I don't know what's tonight's out of the way, but a bit of a breathing time to actually work that out. Go back to a show a week, rather than, or a show a fortnight rather than two shows a week. So, um, yeah, we're just sort of, uh, yeah, we're just looking forward to sort of, you know, finishing up tour. It's nice. It's been great. We're also now, so it's only five shows. We could have, I could have booked another three up north. Um, that I'm, I'm glad I didn't. <laughs> um, so so would you ever think of a South Island tour, or maybe three three tours, like different the cards. South Island's definitely on the cards. Nelson, like Dunedin. Because I'm from Dunedin. Nelson as well. So oh right, right. Yeah. It's kind of like going home. Yeah, yeah. Um, I played Fire Captain Glennon with another band, and then with that, so definitely had to get there. Yeah. Yeah, and you've done a couple of other ones that day. Yeah, Kaikoura and Eblenum uh, yeah, again, Nelson, Mapua, all those sorts of places. So we're sort of, South Island's definitely on the cards. Uh, Wynn, don't know. Um, Tauranga, Auckland, Hamilton, that sort of cluster. Uh, we're looking at doing that sometime. And um, yeah, we just started to look at like some festivals and things like that for summer. And yeah, it's it's busy. It's nice to be busy, and it's yeah. a nice problem to have. However, it can be a little bit hard sometimes when you're like, okay, we just want to have some time to rehearse. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. <laughs> you had to replace the other member with anyone living and dead. Who would it be? Dave Grohl. Dave Logan Grohl. <laughs> Man, so many people say Dave Grohl. He's just he, versatile. He can sing, play guitar, and drums. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and he awesome. rocks it all three. Okay, Josh so. Allen from Queens of Stone Age. He can yeah. replace me. So, so, so Dave Grohl and Josh Homme. Yeah. Yeah yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. He can replace me. I think that'd be a cool replacement. They do the trick. I don't really like Queens of Stone Age. He seems like a real asshole as well. Yeah. I wouldn't want to be in a band with him. Um, what about Desert Session? Do you like some of the Desert Sessions? I'm not a fan of anything he's written. Oh really? Okay. Yeah. Who's the dude Most from people are surprised, uh, Wolf Mother? Something like that. Oh yeah, Andrew. Yeah, Andrew something. No, 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 no. Sound, eh? Yeah. yeah. Um, even like um, Seamus? Like yeah. Seamus? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So good. That, that's I mean, the feel. Stuff. You wouldn't have to move much. You wouldn't even have to return from the dead. It's just like yeah. in Wellington. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Joseph with Dave Grohl. Yeah. Yeah, I could replace with Dave Grohl. But Dave Grohl's like, how are you? I wouldn't be upset. Yeah. Yeah, Dave Grohl's like, I could play drums. like, sorry, bro. You know, what's your dream opening band? Chats. Oh, the Chats. The Chats. For me. I hate them. That was so weird, the Chats were Guns N' Roses. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I was there. Yeah, I was there. Yeah. Um, it was a weird but No, it was a weird lineup. Was it Alien Alien Weaponry as well? Yeah, yeah. weird. We, we, and then Dick Movers opening for them when they come back next year. I. But the chats, the chats would be if the chats played Valhalla and you guys got shoes in this opening, that'd be like a dream. Yeah, dream. I, I would. Yeah. Lots of people on there. I'll be all yeah. over. Um, I I really love like crazy. <laughs> Slightly underground bands like Guitar Wolf came recently. I've seen them a bunch. Oh yeah, Guitar Wolf. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I mean, Seamus, who comes back to, to Wally, I think we'd fit in with that. Um, bluesy Rock and Roll. Bluesy Rock and Roll, yeah, that's sort of what we're about. And you know, it's the whole two piece buzz for us is just nice and easy. Yeah, it's kind of play, yeah, it's great. Like Kyra Knife Fight. Kyra Knife Fight would be also another big one. Yeah. 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 Black Keys. Yeah, Black Keys, like yeah, yeah. You know? Yeah. Um, we'd fit in with that. Yeah, it's just sort of, uh, it's a, yeah, it's bluesy, rock and rolly. But balls to the wall and loud drums and loud guitars and yeah, yeah. rock and roll, man. So that's that's what we're all about. Sweet. <laughs> Just having a good time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Looking forward to it, guys. Okay, cheers.